Righto guys, thought I'd give you a rundown on the boat, what it's made of, how long it took and um, yeah, what an awesome bit of machinery it is. It started out as three bits of corrugated iron, pretty much stomped it into submission after riveting them together, bent the shape, covered it in four layers of fibreglass and resin, um, sanded it in between, did a leak test on it and um, yeah, it was pretty much waterproof at that point. Then we added the cabin to it. Um, then we added the engine to it. I'm thinking about putting a 420 clone in it with just a direct drive. I reckon that could be a giggle. It's um, The seats are just, uh, you know, what they are. Like a piece of wood with some leather and some foam. Forward controls, a handlebar steering. Run by cable. Um, it's got a full lighting setup, tackle boxes, stereo player, and uh, CB radio. Internal lights, external lights. Um, it's got a false floor in it that we uh, filled with expander foam and then sealed so it, it simply can't sink. We've had it full of water and it, yeah, it's not sinking. Probably the coolest part was the shed time. Spending uh, two or three hours every night for five or six months in the shed with the boys just banging out some beers and getting it built and um, We're happy as with it. The overall cost was just under 500 bucks um, And most of it is recycled So the tin was found the marine ply for the floor and the back was found all the stuff for the cabin was found It's um, had a couple of trips into some pretty nasty country and it just did its job it got us everywhere we needed to go the blue stuff on the front is basically for impact so it's self-sealing stuff that they use on the gas pipelines so it amalgamates when you slam it into the rocks so you can shred it pushing her up a bank and um it won't ever leak it's like a bumper bar it's brilliant um probably my favorite thing about it is the fact that it's light it weighs nothing to pick up like I think it's probably 120 kilos, um, and it's all recycled. So get out there, scram some bits, see what you can make, um, and have fun. Cheers.